Okay, so this is Chef AJ's calorie density chart. And Denise listened to her talk at the South of Florida Veg Fest. She was one of our guests in January 2018. So what can you tell people about this? Because I don't, don't really know much about it except for what you've told me uh, very, very recently. <clears throat> so the premise is that everyone eats about three pounds of food a day, whether you whether you realize it or not, even when you're on a diet and you're trying to limit your portion size and you're still hungry at the end of the day, you're going to end up filling up on something like popcorn, for instance. Popcorn is actually on the wrong side of this red line. It is? Just plain popcorn? <laughs> that, or is that yeah, popcorn? Yeah, if you want really? corn, it's... you should eat corn, not popcorn. <laughs> why? Oh, because it... it's processed. Okay. <laughs> well, the idea is all the stuff on the right side of the line is processed food, and it's more calorically dense. It's more than 700 calories per pound. The stuff on the left, if you stay to the left of the red line, you can eat as much as you want and uh, um, theoretically either lose weight or maintain without going hungry. So because there, there are only so many things listed on the left side, like fruit, that's pretty generic. And, and then mm -hmm. she gets into vegetables, what kind of vegetables. Uh, I That's not enough for me to create a shopping list. So I, I did the math on how much all this other food weighs per pound. And I found out that I can also have these other things that are also not well they might be a little processed but they're at least they're vegan yeah. like tofu like um engine two hummus even canned baked beans so some of this stuff comes from a can and is convenient for me to have and maybe it is slightly processed but it's still on the proper side of the line yeah and uh, whole grains they tell you that those are good for you, but I, I did the math on things like oatmeal. Even though it's a whole grain, it, it's still very calorically dense. So I found out that... So any... even though Dr. Gregor eats it every day, yeah. he's just naturally skinny, I guess. Probably. <laughs> so even in all kinds of pasta, even the whole wheat pasta is 1,600 calories per pound. So I put that on the wrong side of the line. The wheat pastas. Wheat pastas, yeah. But if you get rice pasta, it's fine. <laughs> it's over here with rice on the left of the line. Okay. So as I find more interesting stuff to add to my shopping list, I will. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's good to know. Thanks for letting us know about this. Mm-hmm.